Third down and 10. They pick up the pressure. Tuttle downfield. He threw it back shoulder and short. Intended for Freifogel, who has had some huge games this year for head coach Tom Allen. His third down. Third and three. Mertz with time. And that is incomplete. Mertz in this Badger offense. Third and six. Mertz. He's going to have a first down as he goes to Jake Ferguson. Back they've had come into Wisconsin in recent years. Berger, nice job and a stiff arm and then dragging Monster Matthews for a few more yards. Actually drift back where you're supposed to be throwing it. Third down and nine, setting up the screen. Groshek gets free and gets the first down. Looked like he was going to get corralled, and then all of a sudden he burst loose for his offense. 15 yards there. Pressure. Ball is out. As Mertz was taken down. And how about this hit by Mullen? Mertz has no idea. He's thinking he's protected. His field eyes are to the left. Recovered by the defense. Falls on the ground. Second down, Tuttle to the outside. That's Ellis. Second and five, Scott going to test that right edge. He took on the defender and then fell forward for another two yards. That was Sanborn getting involved against Stevie Scott. And now Tuttle quickly gets it to the outside to Hewitt and Hewitt will set up a first and goal for the Hoosiers. It's a pass. Open in the corner of the end zone is Hendershot. So Jack Tuttle with the touchdown pass to Peyton Hendershot. Weeks ago come in in mop-up time against Auburn. Mertz to the outside to Ferguson, and Ferguson goes up and over. High hurdling Jalen Williams, zipping this program and now being able to put on those colors every week. A low snap, and then he goes back to Ferguson, who's able to dodge a defender and get ahead out to the 43 yard line. You see the athleticism from Jake Ferguson. Second down and eight. Mertz with time, but he threw it behind KP Pryor. Flag is down at the 37 yard line. Pass interference. Defense number 23, 15-yard penalty, automatic first down. Second and three now, Berger in the I formation, well blocked, and there he goes. The true freshman from Don Bosco Prep. Asura, they were looking for, but they deserve so much to be celebrated. To the end zone, incomplete. The intended target was prior. Ball, Monona Grove. And he puts it through. So after we had the first scoreless first quarter in the Big Ten all season long, it's now 7-3. Fanless atmosphere at Wisconsin. Tuttle downfield, and he gets a complete to Fillier. So the touchdown pass to Hendershot. Second and five. Scott, as he muscles his way right through the would-be tackle of Jack Sandboy. Third down and ten. This time they pick up the pressure. Tuttle. Incomplete. One against one. Fillier against Hicks. 17 layers on up here in the booth. Tuttle with time. Over the middle as he goes to Bjornsson. Penalty flag is down. Personal foul. Roughing the passer. Contact to the passer's head. Defense. 15 yard penalty. Automatic first down. The middle is a nice pressure. And there he goes. There by Sanborn. Tuttle on first down. Downfield as he goes to Fry Fogel, who goes up and is able to have the contested catch. Ty Fry Fogel. That's the best skill for, for a go-to wide receiver. Ellis, Ellis somehow slipping through, and that'll be a first down for Indiana. Tuttle, corner of the end zone, Fillier, and a touchdown for the Hoosiers. Graham Mertz, good start to this drive as KP, Kendrick Pryor with a chunk play.
out of the effort his teammates are putting on display today. Berger on first down. Jalen Berger now as Wisconsin looks to respond. Third and 12. Mertz intercepted. That is Johnson. And Jamar Johnson with the pickoff of Graham Mertz. Against the Hoosiers. Third and one, tight formation, obvious quarterback sneak. As the ball comes out and Wisconsin says they have it. As you see, coming away with the ball, there's Eric Burrell. Hurts on second and nine. And he's able to find KP. And Kendrick Pryor has Wisconsin on the go here to the 36-yard line. Same more 2020. Berger. As Berger's inside the 20-yard line, a gain of nine there from Jalen Berger. Third and four. To the end zone. Contested and incomplete. Pryor couldn't come up with it. As you saw, Fitzgerald and Mullen there defensively. Larsh made from 29 earlier. This from 28 to cut it to eight. And that's what he does. Four-man rush against Tuttle. Extends it to the right. Calling for some traffic. And then he's met hard that time by Sanborn. And Nelson, and a flag is down. Nelson and Sanborn collapsing on Tuttle. Pulls in a cotton ball, but I'm trying to think of the root of the orange ball. Mertz on second and 12, and Mertz is able to get it with DK. Third down and four. Mertz trying to keep this drive going, and he does so. And once again, it's Jim Ray DK. A 17-yard completion to DK. Inside his own five. Third down and six. Mertz, boy, sailed it high. So it'll be fourth down here. Underneath. Third and ten. Tuttle. Incomplete. Flag is down back at the 34-yard line. So they're thinned out at receiver. Second and one. Mertz. Just hooks it up over the middle to the rival Jake Ferguson. Made a big comeback here in a potential two-minute situation. Safety blitz. He quickly gets it out, and in doing so, will get a good play to Eschenbach. Very good referee. Nice job there. Third down and eight. Mertz. He's going to tuck, run, and get it. And a whole lot more before he slides down near the 30. Big play, Graham Mertz. Under a minute to play. Third down and ten after the sack. This time they drop eight, and that is incomplete. He was trying to hook up with Jake Ferguson, but Jones had coverage. It is fourth down. Fourth down and ten. Bad snap. It rolled on the ground. Mertz to the end zone. Incomplete. DK had a shot at it, but Indiana holds. Re 